Okay, friends, our last activity at Circle Time today is a new poem, and this poem has a clue. So I'm going to give you the clue, and if you think you know the answer to the clue, you're going to raise your hand because the clue tells us what our new poem is about. So this is the clue. This is something you can find at the grocery store in the fruit section, and it comes in red, yellow, or green. Does anybody know what our new poem might be about? Does anybody have any ideas? Uh, Ruth, what's your idea? Tomatoes. Ruth thinks it's about tomatoes. Hmm, that's a good guess, but our poem is actually about apples. Because apples can be red, yellow, or green. So, I need everybody to put their hand out. Just one hand out and wiggle your fingers. Wiggle your fingers. We're going to count backwards with our hands, because we have to know how to count backwards for our special poem. So let's go. Five, four... Three, two, one. Okay, now everybody knows how to come backwards with our hands. So first, I'm gonna read the poem and my big friends are gonna read it with me. And then for the second time, I'll show you the picture. But you need your hand out and you gotta wiggle your fingers, get your fingers ready, wiggle them. Okay, now we're ready. It goes like this. Five juicy apples sitting in the store. Missy ate one and that leaves four. Four juicy apples, pretty as can be. Lindsay ate one, and that leaves three. Three juicy apples, yummy through and through. Heather ate one, and that leaves two. Two juicy apples, what a handsome pair. Christine ate one, now one is sitting there. One juicy apple, sitting all alone. Marisa ate it, and that leaves none. Grocer, grocer, please order more. We like to buy apples when we visit your store. Now, here's the picture. See, and there's the apples. And there's the grocer. He's the person that sells the apples. And then there's some little friends with some money. And it looks like they're ready to buy some apples. So we're going to do it once more. So everybody get your hands out. and wiggle your fingers. Get them ready. Okay. Five juicy apples sitting in the store. Missy ate one, and that leaves four. Four juicy apples, pretty as can be. Lindsay ate one, and that leaves three. Three juicy apples, yummy through and through. Ruth ate one, that leaves two. Two juicy apples, what a handsome pair. Gina ate one, now one is sitting there. One juicy apple sitting all alone. Marisa ate it, and that leaves none. Grocer, grocer, please order more. We like to buy apples when we visit your store. All right, friends, thanks for doing that poem with me. That was a lot of fun.